Those who filed a lawsuit against the PDP's presidential candidate Atiku Abubakar to contest the outcome of the PDP primaries are lazy people. These were the words of Frank Shaibu, who is the special assistant on public communication to Atiku Abubakar. According to him, the current situation in Nigeria is not about geography or ethnic differences, but more about intentions and actions. The, the primary election held, it was won and lost. Then after the victory, after the declaration of Atiku, we now return to say, look, we want to now start an agitation in the middle of the road to say, look, Atiku is presidential candidate, he is from, the, he is from northern Nigeria. It was not by appointment, it was by election in a fair context. That nobody protested, nobody contested, nobody, nobody, nobody even proceeded to court, apart from uh, some lazy guys who took the battle to court only recently and claiming that he, he had an interest. But that's an issue for another day. So the issue now is, what is, what are we asking for? On daily basis, the only testimonial of this government in several years has been that of tears, that of death senseless massacre. We have over 18 million out of school children in Nigeria today. Over 18 million out of school children. Our universities have been shut for over six months. I heard a minister of the Federal Republic of Nigeria said the other day that parents should go and, you know, and, and, and prostrate to ASU so that they can come back to school and all that. It's marks of wretched illiteracy. So we need someone who can unite us who can use our dynamic diversity as a unifying factor? Nigeria is one of the most heterogeneous societies in the world. One of the most heterogeneous societies in the world. We have multiple ethnic groups. And, but this government has divided us along religious lines, tribal lines, political lines, sectional lines, then insecurity. Insecurity, in fact, is the mother of all. Because without security, nothing can happen. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.